next month, there will be a new face under the Spider-Man costume. Cutting edge comic book fans will say goodbye to Peter Parker and hello to Miles Morales, the new Spider-Man for a new generation, according to Marvel Comics. Alex Alonzo, Marvel's editor-in-chief, he is the man weaving this new web of intrigue, and he joins us here this morning. Alex, good to have you here. Thanks. So when you first became editor-in-chief, you said, I'm going to do something different, something bold. This is probably as, as bold as you could possibly go. No more Peter Parker. It's now Miles Morales, half black, half Hispanic. This is, a, I mean, a total change. What made you decide to do something this bold? Well, we were concocting a story in Ultimate Comics, which is a, a line of comics which uh, is a parallel universe to the Marvel Universe that involved the death of Spider-Man. And the obvious question was, you know, when you have an iconic figure of this importance die, you know, who do you replace him with? And, you know, we've got a president right now of mixed ethnicity, so yeah. we figured why not the most recognizable superhero in the world? Has it been received? Because you're going to have those purists out there that I'm, I'm sure are a little bit uh, shock and awe, but, but what has uh, the response been? Oh, our fans are passionate, so of course, you know, we heard from the naysayers right away, but the response has been overwhelmingly positive. I got a, an email this morning from a Wall Street banker who said, you know, he can't wait to bring this home to his son who's three and is already uh, already raiding his comic book stash. Yeah. When, when, when pe will people actually be able to see it? Uh, today, I'll Ultimate Comics 4 is on stands today, and you'll get your first glimpse of Miles Morales. Uh, he's uh, half African American, half Hispanic, young kid from Brooklyn, and he's a nerd like Peter Parker. Yeah, so how is he different, though? I mean, what, what's going to be the, the real big difference between the two? For everybody who's used to Peter Parker, how is Miles now different? Well, one significant difference is that Miles' parents are still alive. And in fact, they will play a major role in the story, so you'll meet him. Uh, Peter Parker never had that luxury. Uh, but apart from that, you know, there's a lot of similarities, you know. Spider-Man works best when he's a conflicted kid, a kid looking to fit in, a kid who's always aspiring, always looking to uh, achieve and never quite getting exactly what he needs. And this is an idea you've had for a long time. This isn't something that just came up when you got the job. You've been sitting on this for quite oh, a while. Oh, yeah, we've been talking about this for a while, you know. Quite frankly, the first discussion I remember that was very concrete was when we were, it was right before uh, Obama was elected, and we started to realize that we might very well be looking at the first African-American president. Yeah. You were just at Comic-Con uh, not too long ago, right? Yes, I was. And uh, I guess was Andrew Garfield from The Social Network is actually playing Spider-Man on the big screen. Yes. So who was able to garner more attention? Your new Spider-Man? or Garfield as a new Spider-Man? Well, it's a toss-up, you know. <laughs> I'd say, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw a black Spider-Man in cinema sometime down the road. Were you a little, were you disappointed that they maybe that the big screen didn't go that route as well? Uh, like, well, you know, we're in different time tracks, so, you know, we're, in publishing we move so, so quickly, you know, we turn on the dime. The plans for the movie were well underway, but like I said, I, I wouldn't be surprised. We're, we tend to be quite influential. Yeah, you might be onto something <laughs> here, huh? but the, fan, the, the feedback from the fans has been positive. Oh, yeah, it's, it's been great. I, I'm very, very excited to see, and again, you can get your first glimpse of Spider-Man today. Great. Superb. Alex, thanks so much. Good Thank to see you. you.